just got my new Hoover wind tunnel vacuum cleaner for Red Butt Inn. Ordered from the good fine people at Quill.com. This is my packing order, packing list. Uh, it doesn't show prices. I'll show you that maybe later. I didn't pay that much for this. How dirty this floor is. It's in pretty rough shape. Carpet fibers and hairs. So I cleaned up this whole room worth of carpet, 12 by 15 foot room. side. So when both sides start filling up, you know that you better clean out the canister. It's going to start losing performance. It has this indicator on the top too, which you see is showing a little bit of red now, indicating that the vacuum has done some work. I noticed that the cord was getting a little hot though, and I thought maybe this is more than just the cord being close to the motor, which is a little warm. But I think it's also probably not a good idea to have this cord coiled up when you're running so much amperage through it because a coil of wire is an inductor that resists the flow of current. And so in resisting the flow of current, it takes that current, turns it into heat, and the wire is getting hot. 
that might even be a safety issue. I'm not sure. I'm sure they've underwriters laboratory have looked at this, but I would recommend that you have this thing pulled out. Maybe not all the way out, but you should have this thing pulled out to at least the halfway out from the yellow marker so that your cord doesn't heat up on you inside the vacuum makes it run better and I think this thing is probably pushing some serious amperage so it's just a lot safer I think that way to contain it now look at all this dirt simple process to take it apart just pull the lift the latch takes the whole thing out in your hand and you go do 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 wherever you want to go to empty it out So our initial analysis is this works pretty darn good. It outperforms even a shop vac on a moderate shag carpet. As I use it more, as you can see it's filling up. It's almost to the fullest of its capacity. And you can tell that by the use monitor. When I turn it on, the pressure tells you how much you can fill it before it's completely full. <laughs> where it is right now and I've been using it for a decent amount of time now but I haven't shown you all the tools and how they work I haven't shown you emptying the, the container yet so what I'm asking you to do is subscribe and keep coming back because there's going to be follow-ups to this video and to my lawnmower video and to all the other useful videos for all you property managers out there so keep coming back